All right, hello, my name is Daryl, and this is module three of a conversation. So I'm already connected to the robot, and uh, first thing we're going to do is find the choice box. Come over here. All right, and if we double click on the choice box, You'll notice that there is a say, like a localized text. This is what uh, you get the robot to say. And you have a choice box, and you have these different choices you can do. So right now the question is, do you like chocolate? And the answer is going to be yes or no. Um, right now, both outputs from the choice box are going to the same output of this part, which is this uh, answer on command. So um, what we're going to do is double click on here and we're going to change this to pressure. And we're going to change these to um, make this talk. Talk and So when I created this, another um, output from this choice box happened. So to have each one of these uh, be their own individual action, we're going to add more output. So we're going to call this output, and we're going to change the nature. Uh, we'll leave it as a bang, so we're going to change the nature to on stop. So the way I did that was I just um, right clicked on this output and I'm going to change it from type string to bang. Yeah, talk, point, and both. I'm going to connect this to here and then uh, for the talk I'm going to grab the say box and that's out here. So if I double click on this, we have this localized text, say localized text, which is very familiar to this part of the choice box. Hello. Don't type to this. No, or you know. And then uh, for the points, we're going to go down to point at. So if you right click, you probably learn this from all your other tutorials, but if you click on this wrench, you have all the different parameters. So what I'm going to change is the left arm, and we're going to slow this down to about 30%, 36% speed. Point back there, and then we're going to copy both of these. Sure why that's not working, but okay, whatever. That worked. Wow, this is going really weird today. Sorry about that. But here we go. Point first, and then we're gonna say. So you can have different outputs in series, like how this is, and you can have different outputs in parallel, which I'll show you after this. So um, another thing you can do is you can have your outputs go all the way to the end, and you'll have to rerun the program, or you could re-bring them back around to the choice box. So I'm going to bring this back around. So once it says it, it's going to come back in here and ask me 
こうなだけで、あの、センセーション、あの、私も、ちょっと待ってください。そう、あの、もし読みしてるかもしれないです。So you see how it wrapped all the way back around and back to the choice box? Point. Point. What did you like me to do? So if you notice right here,、um, you can see what the robot says. Both. What did you like me to do? Both. Both. Yeah, so she's not listening. Both. That was pretty bad. But,、um, let me stop this. So I'm going to change this to. What did you like me to do? Both. Both. Hello, my name is Mel. So,、um, the first thing it did was it executed this point at, and then the second thing it did was say. But you can have both of these actions happen at the same time by having them in parallel. So, since I changed the program, I had to rerun it.、Um, and、What would you like me to do? Both. Both. Hello, my name is Mel. So, that wasn't, it didn't seem like it happened、um, separately because this point happened so fast. But、um, when you have Different boxes in parallel. It executes both of them at the same time. So you might want to program like an introduction, like an intro when somebody comes in. You can have the robot stand up. While the robot is standing up, you can have the robot introduce itself. So,、um, yeah, that's the, introdu the introduction to the choice box. Oh, yeah, and one more thing. You can also connect multiple choice boxes together. And you can have Interesting conversation.、Um, um, even have the robot react to different ways or different ways to、um, different choices that happen in the choice box. So, yeah, that was the introduction to the choice box. And、um, I'll see you guys in another module.